Hi everyone in this video we are going to show you what features you will get in our premium LDAP plugin. Here is the list of features in premium LDAP plugin. We are in the LDAP configuration tab. Here we have specified the LDAP server URL, distinguished name and password of LDAP user account. You can configure multiple search bases separated by semicolon in this field. Here you can specify the username attribute using which you want to login in your site. Such as some account name, mail, etc. Enable custom search filter option. Here you can also write your own search filter with custom conditions. Here you can test the user authentication. Enable LDAP login to allow users to login into your site with LDAP credentials. Using this feature you can allow user to login with LDAP as well as WordPress credentials. This feature provides you the landing page selection for the users after login into the site. You can also provide custom URL for the redirection. This option creates users automatically in your site after they login into the site. Using this feature user will be forcefully authenticated before accessing the content of the site. Go to the Role Mapping tab. Here you can select the default WordPress role to assign the user. Save the mapping. Enable Role Mapping will allow you to assign WordPress roles based on below Role Mapping configuration. Login with LDAP user credentials. You can see the default configured role is assigned to the user after login. In this text field you can provide DN of the group and select the WordPress role which you want to assign to the users for specified group. Here you can specify the LDAP attribute which contains group membership information. Save the mapping. You can test your role mapping configuration by entering the username in this text field. You can see the list of roles that will be assigned to the users. Login with the LDAP user credentials. Now you can see the configured roles are assigned to the user. You can select another WordPress role for the configured group. Save the mapping. This feature adds new roles by keeping existing roles untouched. Login with the LDAP user credentials. Now you can see the new subscriber role is added and existing roles are not removed. You can enable this option to fetch subgroups of the parent group. Go to Attribute Mapping tab. Here you can configure LDAP attributes for basic WordPress profile. You can add custom LDAP attributes here to fetch extra attributes from LDAP server. Save the configuration. Enabling this option will update the user profile. 
Here you can test the attribute mapping by entering the username in the text field. This are the LDAP attributes information fetched from LDAP server. Login with LDAP user credentials. You can see WordPress user profile is updated with LDAP attributes values. Enabling this option will allow you to update the user profile in LDAP server when updated from WordPress. Update the first name and last name values of the user. Now retest the attribute mapping by entering username in the text field. You can see the WordPress user profile is updated in the respective LDAP attributes. Go to Configuration Settings tab. Here you can export your plugin configuration from the staging or testing site and import on the production or live site. Enable this option if you want to export the LDAP service account password. Click here to download the plugin configuration in JSON file. You can import the configuration by uploading the plugin configuration JSON file. Go to Authentication Report tab. You can enable this option to start logging authentication requests. You will get detailed information in this table for individual user. This option will allow you to keep users logging report even after uninstalling the plugin. Thank you for choosing Mini Orange. For more information reach miniorange.com or you can contact us at info at secure5.com.